Hi all, past two days, the entire media discussed me about the term deep seek and lot of debates is going on the entire world in the name of deep seek and let me can have you some time to explore the platform of deepseek.com. If you want to reach deepseek.com, just you can google it and type deepseek.com. This is the interface of deepseek.com and I'm just going to give you a small overview about this platform and DeepSeek R1 is now live as an open source software you know this and revealing open AI model and now it's available as a web and mobile application as well as the API and this interface DeepSeek into unknown suppose you want to know something as part of your unknown things let you can ask let you can chat with this DeepSeek and if you want to get Air applications as part of your mobile phone just to click deep sick app kit you'll get the QR code and just scan it and get into this and these are the deep sick capabilities v3 capabilities and this is a platform they're comparing the different uh, models like uh, GPT 40 uh, Clady 3.5 uh, Lima 3.1 like this different model they are comparing with this deep sick V3 model. So this is the interface. If you want, you can go through this, the code as well as the math and in the way Chinese they given the different uh, comparisons. Um, they highlighted in what way DeepSeek V4 is better than or uh, how the V3 is to be more capability than the other. Like this, they give a lot of comparisons. Now I'm just going to give a small overview how we can access this DeepSeek, uh, particularly how we can do chatting with this kind of uh, dipstick for this we can click the start now when you click start now it moves the another interface that's interface called chat deepseek.com you can see this the chat deepseek.com and here this interface same like chat gpt or Gemini. hi i am deepseek uh, so this interface look like uh, the other uh, chatbot only and we have the model deep think r1 model this for the google search or the search is there and this is an attachment and we can upload maximum uh, 50 to 100 MP only. So there's an upload capabilities. We can upload as a document as well as the image. So there are options on that. And suppose I want to do some kind of discussion with uh, DeepSeek. I'm just asking the prompting like this. As a researcher, as a researcher, how can I use Deep seek to my research. Enter. <coughs> when you ask this question, is giving a wonderful insights. Deep seek is a Chinese company dedicated to making AG a reality. If you want to use Deep seek product, they give a different uh, idea. Identify your research needs as a Deep seek tools. Review documentation tutorials like this is given a lot of idea how as a researcher I can use the DeepSeek. Suppose I want to do some comparative analysis with the DeepSeek with the chat GPT. I'm just asking this uh, question as a prompting here. Compare the capabilities of DeepSeek with chat GPT. For I'm just specified 4.0. We can ask these questions to the chatbot. And DeepSeek is giving wonderful insights. DeepSeek and ChatGPT are both advanced AI systems, very good. And but they have a different focus. And core focus, DeepSeek, this is a focus, is developed by Chinese company, is developed by OpenAI lady. So there's a some kind of comparator analysis and actual language processing, NLP, they give the different uh, Comparisons, the research and industry applications, customizing integrations, and language region focus, and ethical regulatory comparisons. So, like this, list a lot of comparative analysis with the two tools like DeepSeek and ChatGPT 4.0. And you give the summary over also. Suppose I want to do some kind of other prompting like this. As a academicians, how can you use the uh, DeepSeek? Or as a teacher, how can you use you? As a teacher, how can I use the effectively deep sick enter? So when you go with the enter, you can see this model very falsely compared to the other 
a chatbot. So now it started to think and after it's going to produce wonderful insights based on our content. So let's give you an overview. And the same like the other uh, chatbot, we have some history also. Today which are things we discussed will be available here. And now you can see, I see a teacher, DeepSeek is giving the personalized learning support, content creation uh, lesson plan, is giving the lesson plan, student engagement interactions, very good, assessment feedback, portion development, it is sort of a wonderful idea how the teachers can utilize the DeepSeek. Because as a teacher, as an academician, I want to use this kind of to ethically as well as effectively, that's the reason I just asked this kind of prompting. And you can see it gives a wonderful insights getting a stand, uh, started team six. It gives a wonderful insights about uh, how the teachers can use it. And suppose I'm asking the questions, are you able to prepare a PPT, prepare a PowerPoint? I'm asking this prompting to the deep sick. I'm asking the question to that in deep sick. We can see whether how it's responding. We can wait for this. The pro the idea so I'm waiting for this the answer which I will keep sick. So still so thinking and finally give a wonderful insights. And meanwhile, we can see this this is a close sidebar. If you want to close, you can use the sidebar. And we have get apps. If you want to change anything, you can use it. Oh, the server is big. You know this. Nowadays, people most of people started to use much. That's the reason the server is always busy with this. I'm asking a similar kind of questions in a different way. Uh, whether deep sick having the capable having the uh, capabilities uh, to generate a PPT like uh, gamma. I'm asking this questions. We can see how it's given. As no, Deep does not have dedicated features capability, so it's not able to generate it people directly. So it may be helping this capabilities only, right? Uh, content creations may be helping. So it can generate it text can give some kind of idea about text generation. It gives the data analysis visualization, multilingual support. This way is helping us. I hope you are getting some insight how to use the Deep Sick uh, AI. Thank you so much for your passive listen on this video. We meet in the next uh, wonderful video in the future videos. Thank you all. Bye once again.